Today, we're diving into something super exciting and cutting edge in the world of image editing. Imagine being able to tweak a photo just by typing out what you want to change. Sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, right? Well, it's real, and it's called LEdits Plus Plus. This amazing tool is a game changer in how we edit images. It's like having a magic wand, but instead of waving it, you type your wishes into existence. Whether you want to add something cool to a picture, remove an unwanted object, or even completely change the style, LEdits Plus Plus does it all with just a few words. What makes it stand out is its incredible speed, versatility, and precision. It's not just about slapping a filter on a photo. It's about making specific, detailed changes without messing up the rest of the image. So, buckle up, and let's explore how LEdits Plus Plus is revolutionizing image editing, making it faster, more flexible, and ultra-precise. Whether you're a pro photographer or just love playing around with photos on your phone, this is something you won't want to miss. Let's get started. Let's fire up Pinocchio and get LEdits Plus Plus installed with only one click. If you're new to my channel, you probably don't have Pinocchio. If that's the case, pause this video and head over to Pinocchio.computer and download and install Pinocchio. Now that you have Pinocchio launched, click on Discover and find Lidits Plus Plus. Next click Download and then Install. This will take some time. Now would be a good time to subscribe if you haven't already. Also, if you're enjoying these one-click install AI tool videos, then be sure to join the Pinocchio Discord. If you have any issues, simply open a ticket on their Discord and someone will help you out. Once Lidits Plus Plus is installed, click Launch. From there you will see it start to download the safe tensor files aka checkpoints. These files are usually large and can take some time. As you can see, the initial install took around 6-7 to seven minutes. Before Pinocchio, you'd have to go through all types of crazy bash commands to get these AI tools installed. That is why I love Pinocchio so much. They make it easy for the average person to be able to test all of these amazing and awesome AI tools. Keep in mind I am not sponsored by them or know any of them personally. I just love what they are doing and vouch for it. Once everything is installed and successfully launched, you will see this interface. Let's give this a try with one of the example images. As you can see, the image on the left is the original and the image on the right is the edited image with glasses. Let's give her a beard. Okay, that didn't work. Let's up the guidance scale a bit. Perfect. Oh, art thou my bearded lady. However, seems like she is missing the glasses. So the guidance scale will increase how strongly the concept should modify the image. By increasing the guidance scale you increase the chances of that edit. Wow, very artsy. Let's try with some of the other example images. So I loaded this example car image, and by default it gave a bit of settings such as cherry blossom and green cabriolet. However, let me totally change this. I'll do something simple like black car. Okay, that looks peach to me. Maybe we need to up the guidance scale? Okay, that didn't work. Let me try with change the car color to black and I'll leave edit type as custom. Whoa. Okay, let's try a simple black car with a guidance of 10.5. Damn, just don't want to work for me. Okay, after messing around a bit more, I tried green truck and it sort of changed it to a truck however it's white. Let's try some other examples. I'll remove these default pink tulips and red flower settings from this example and replace it with sunflower. How much better? Okay, cool, that seemed to add a sunflower. Awesome. Almost forgot to change to a dark theme. Much easier on my eyes. In case you were wondering, is it possible to use Lidits Plus Plus online without having to install it? The answer is yes. However, it's flooded at the moment and you're more than likely to be added to a queue. As I was filming this example online, it totally gypped me, giving me a blank image. Oh well, that's usually the case when I am filming and editing. Anyways, yes you'll be able to use Lidits Plus Plus online with the queue. Let's take a closer look at some of these examples. Cat with sunglasses, this example shows a change to George Clooney. More examples of a cat with sunglasses. This one shows the original image in the center with the parameters decreased smile to the left and increased smile to the right. Then we got this car example here. I don't know about you, but Let It's Plus Plus is pretty fun to play with. From adding beards to cars that just won't turn black, we've seen the quirky, artistic potential of this tool. It's clear that Let It's Plus Plus offers a playground for our imaginations, making image editing not just accessible, but also a lot of fun. I encourage you all to give it a whirl, play around with different settings, and see what crazy, beautiful, or downright hilarious edits you can come up with. And hey, if you create something you're proud of or something that makes you laugh share it with me and the community post your creations in the comments who knows
goals, your masterpiece might just be the inspiration for my next video. Remember, whether you're using the online version or experimenting with Pinocchio, let its plus plus opens up a world of creative possibilities right at your fingertips. So, keep exploring, keep creating, and keep having fun with it. And, as always, if you found this video helpful, give it a like, share it with friends, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Your support means a lot and helps me bring more content like this to you. Until next time, keep tweaking those pixels and stay creative. This is AI Controversy, signing off. Catch you in the next one.